Hello. I know it's been a little while. Yeah, I am rocking my old Batix shirt. Giving you a little spin in the back as well. This is about 13, 14 years old, this shirt. Um, if the club does survive and gets a buyer, I'm waiting for the new season and I will be buying a brand new shirt. Uh, just so I can stick my money where my mouth is. Since I've been asking a lot of people out there, um, even if you don't really like football, at least buy a bit of merch just to help us out a bit. Uh, I did help Bolton out quite a bit as well uh, when they had a fundraiser the other year as well. So I put about 150 quid into that one. So far on the fundraiser this year, I've put about the same for us, but I'm going to be getting one of our new shirts soon yes i know it has been a while i've not forgotten about that i've not forgotten about rugby or anything like that rugby stuff will be coming through soon things have changed with work working a bit more doing more late shifts uh I've got more sunday shifts coming on as well so things are changing just a wee bit with that along with a few other bits and pieces. The Alton Towers trip has definitely been put into place, which is going on in October, so Scarefest. Yay! Yay, Scarefest! Uh, basically, this is going to be a recap of things, but yeah, for any of you out there who are football fans, especially out in America or anywhere else, it's not all about Premier League. Lower leagues do need money too. We all need money. Um, for Wigan, we are having problems too. So, yes. Looks like Cook is leaving us. I'm not much of a football fan, by the way. I'll go watch the game because I'm a 5-10 minute walk up the road from the stadium so i'll go watch the games when there's a tasty game and it's like a, a, a local derby things like that because so i watched the preston game i've watched the boat at the bottom of the blackburn game i'm seeing us beat norwich the last um the season prior we've beaten swansea we've done all sorts of really good ones you know i've seen a load of those i don't watch any of the lives i haven't seen any live streams but i have seen the highlights the eight goal thriller against hull was amazing Shame we went down now. I'm kind of a fan, kind of not. I'm a fan by proxy, the location to it. I am more interested in rugby, but hey, football is something to watch when you've got nothing else to do on a, on a Saturday afternoon or when there's the occasional tasty uh, late game in the week. And you can do that. It's quite nice. If things improve and things start changing, covid wise i may start going to the game i might just vlog one or two of those but my vlogs will be mainly surrounding the rugby stuff so i haven't forgotten about that a friend of mine from the states has got his rugby shirt so yay so he's got his rugby shirt so that's brilliant that one in there so at least that was a decent present that i managed to get out for someone <laughs> it was a cheeky present that i thought that i would be able to get in um before the COVID stuff kicked in, but unfortunately it got delayed by a long way. Um, this is going to be a random ramble, by the way. So this is just going to be me just chatting shit for a while. So yeah, I've got my new tablet, which... That, that's going to be used more for scripting and things like that in the future. This is just a free run because I'm on my own script. Room, as you can see, has still stag well, stabilised, not stagnated, but hey, things will have to be organised better in here at some point, but it is only a small room. I'm still waiting to sort out my carpet, just because, well, that was obviously going to be a delay because of COVID. Uh, there's a lot of things that have been delayed because of COVID, but hey, who gives a shout about that right now? As long as the world keeps ticking, we'll be fine. Uh, yeah. Rugby Challenge Cup does seem to be going a little bit weird, especially after what happened with Wolfpack, because they've pulled out. Now, are they going to be coming back or what? Sonny Bill Williams ain't going to be with them from next season anyway, because he's going back to Oz. Looks like he's thinking, I think he's going back to the Roosters. 
So that'll be uh, a bit of fun there. So Sonny Bill going back to Sydney Roosters. As for what's going on with the rest of the lads, we don't exactly know. Whereas with everything being behind closed doors, it does make it a little bit difficult sometimes. But we will see. We will see. September, August will start with some of the games kicking up in some places. So August Rugby League will kick off again. All behind closed doors at select areas. Not including up here yet, as far as I'm aware anyway. If that is wrong, bang it on down below. Also, with the crowds going in, it could be September, October time. So where I'm going to be away. My extended time away as well, so I'm going to have two days away at Alton Towers, which there might be a single vlog or a double vlog. There's also probably going to be a travel vlog from around Nottingham, because I'm going to be having a two-day trip around Nottingham too. So it's going to be a bit of fun. So, if there's anywhere down below you would like me to see around the Nottingham area, because I do want to do uh, some of the stuff around the Sherwood Forest experience and some of the Robin Hood trails, want to do that. Uh, if there is anything that exclusive or like Fright Nighty that you want me to do for Alton Towers, bang it on down below because all comments will help. Hey, I will try to comment back to you. Now I've got multiple devices to actually reply to you on. I will try my hardest to reply to you. If there's anything else that you would like me to try to cover, like more news on the football, I'll try and get more up-to-date news on the rugby because I'm a little bit out of the loop due to working and stuff like that. So I will do what I can to get things recorded for you. If there's anything you would like me to do video-wise, like micro-vlogs, probably go for a little walk and have a bitch the camera while I'm walking around the perimeter of the stadium, try that. You know, I've asked a few questions in a couple of groups that I'm in. Some of the questions we already covered before in previous ones. If there's anything you'd like to cover, just bang it on down below. I might start doing a bit more gameplay when I get the time as well, because I've got some things going on. I have got the rugby challenge. I can find where I put it. Yep, I have got rugby league challenge four in here too, along with a lot of other stuff as well. I've got obviously I've got FIFA, Destiny, got some racing games, got a bit of Fallout, I've got City Builder and Six Skylines. Then moving on back over onto the Xbox stuff. F1, Halo, Pez, obviously. Now an old school classic from the PS2 days. Oh come here. I haven't actually played this one for a long time. Not since the PS2, and I didn't exactly complete it back then. So this is another one I'm probably going to be pumping quite a lot of hours into. Like I said, this is going to be random. And at one point in the near future, my hair will be going blue. I've had it purple, I've had it red, I've had all sorts of other colours. I haven't had it blue for a while, so I might as well go blue. Why not? I'll go blue! It's just fun going blue. Wrong blue, I know, but hey. That decision to go blue was done a long time before anything to do with these lot went wrong. I know for some of you who have seen me in rugby shirts, this might be a bit alien, but I had this shirt before I had a rugby shirt. Unfortunately, because I bought this one for a coaster meetup years ago. Because it's got my old coaster force name on the back. So the new one will have my surname on, obviously, because I'm going to name it. I'm still keeping the number 13 because it's my power number. Don't know why. I've always liked the number 13, so it's my power number. As for the rest of it, hey, I don't know what I'm going to be doing. A lot of these are going to be all around vlog, in the vlog type, all mainly around when I get back from work, when I've got time to, and when I get the chance to do any recording. Because a lot of the time, I don't get a lot of time. But as soon as I get back from work, I'm either really knackered, or I just cannot be arsed. Unfortunately, if you need to do videos, you've got to have the time, and you've got to put the effort in to make them good. Now, as you can tell, my edit skills ain't exactly the, great, the greatest. A lot of the time I just bang them up raw, which is kind of sometimes easier. When I'm being lazy, I just bang them up raw. But hey, I will do my best to sort them all out for you. 
Oh, by the way, some of you didn't be able to see the box earlier as well. Oh, on one of the previous vlogs. S20 5G. You still be recording on my old cell, by the way, but there she is. Here in the case. It's easier keeping it in a case because this one's a bit more glass. It's a lot more expensive than this thing that I'm recording you on. Because if this one that I'm recording you on breaks, it doesn't really matter because that's replaceable. This one, on the other hand, is a lot harder to replace. There you go. A bit of Warriors on there. And the rest of it, as they say, just because I'm a, because I'm a furry. Oh, I'm a furry. Yeah. Back down on there. He says as he drops one. And I might as well do the old cryptic. And there she is. On the tab. Anyway. My paws up. Salute. Remember, anything you want to know, bang it down below and I'll see what I can do in the next video. If there's any suggestions that you've got for any new content and things like that. If you do want to see some gameplay, I do have an Elgato. I will try to hook it up and get it working. I've still got to play about with that. I'm still running on my old PC. So my old PC can run the Elgato, but it will get a bit hot. So I'm waiting to build a new one, which is going to take me a while. For games, if you've got any other suggestions of what games that I should get, bang them down below. If you've got vlog suggestions, bang them down below. If you've got anything to do with Alton Towers or around the Nottingham area that I should investigate, because I do want to have a see around the football clubs as well. See Notts County and see if I can get into have a wander around Forest as well at that point. See if there's any like um, display things going on or whatever, or if you can do any of the tours around there. I might see if I can do that. I might vlog some of them up. I know it's not really going to be much in the, in the way for rugby at the moment, but I'm trying to find some more content. I'm trying to record some content. If there is anything that you can suggest, smash it all down below. And as always, smash that like, comment. If you're not already subbed, please sub up because we always need subs. Everyone's asking for subs. We all need the subs. And like I said at the beginning, if you can do, please buy some merch for these boys because they really need the help. After being screwed over by that moron who banged in that bet, and now we're losing most of our other stuff, and we've been banged down into the league below, even though we shouldn't have been relegated, but we have been relegated because of the technicalities. Then, as always, I'm out. Peace!